All right. Hi, guys. So, uh, after after another day of, uh, of coding, I've managed to implement uh, Microsoft's automatic graph layout implementation, or MSAGL, and I've pulled that in, and it's so much better than GraphSharp, the, the thing I was using before. So, this is an example of a tech tree that it generated for me, or that it laid out for me. I'm still generating the tech tree myself, and look at how much cleaner it is than the results from the previous video. I mean, it's night and day. This is absolutely wonderful. And it's even handling multiple dependencies. Like you can see, in many places, there's a technology that depends on more than one ancestor technology. When I put that into a graph previously, uh, it just completely fucked everything up. It would turn into a snarled, rat's nest, horribly ugly, but Microsoft's automatic graph layout algorithm just handles it flawlessly. It is so good. Look at these. These are great. Like it still, it still makes some long, long lines sometimes. That's this isn't ideal. Right? That, that right there, not good. But you know, most of most of them, pretty clean, pretty clean. Okay, there's no reason for that one to be over there. So it still messes up sometimes, yeah. But the last one messed up all the time. And this is a huge graph. And notice, notice how quick it is, right? Like it's at least ten times faster. Than graph sharp, and I, and I think that the algorithmic complexity is 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 just better. It looks like n log n rather than n squared or cubed. Look at those! It's so cute. Hmm. Absolutely lovely. Really digging it. Let's see another one. Oh, yeah. Mm. Yes, yeah, long line sometimes. No ideal. What's happening here? <laughs> Look at that. So, like with the uh, with the multiple dependencies, for example, you're researching tech 217 here, and then in order to get a 350, 357, you have to go down these two diverging chains of technologies which then converge into a higher tech item which is super interesting and that's something that we're going to do in our actual tech tree so i wanted to make sure that uh, i was handling that even in the test environment mm, so good so good that's a sprawling tree these are actually two different trees yeah you know, colorblind, so uh, can't really see the difference here between these two. Very good. Very good. So hot. It's like this technology over here, 20, is uh, very fruitful, has a lot of descendants. Mm. Very good. So, like, now I'm done with. Uh, <laughs> layout algorithms for now, but Microsoft automatic graph layout, you guys are the best. Oh, I will show for Microsoft any day of the week. All right, calling it a day. Have a good one.